my friends today my topic is clearance it is uh, continuation to part 1 iv one compartment open model we have only left with only one parameter clearance first of all we we have to know what is clearance clearance is defined as the volume of the drug cleared from plasma we know the difference between what is volume of distribution and clearance volume of distribution relates plasma drug concentration and the amount of the drug in the body whereas clearance relates plasma drug concentration with the rate of elimination so clearance is equal to rate of elimination by plasma drug concentration cl is equal to dx by dt by c units what are the units of clearance ml per minute or liter per hour clearance is also be classified as plasma clearance blood clearance or clearance based on free drug concentration we have to know total body clearance before going to total body clearance we have to know individual organ clearance suppose we can take a renal clearance then rate of elimination by particular organ like kidney by concentration of drug in the kidney similarly uh, similarly hepatic clearance other other clearances then we add these additive properties renal clearance plus hepatic clearance plus other others they can be, then we can get total clearances so friends we, we know clt total clearance is equal to dx by dt by c from this equation we can transform this equation into ke into x by c because dx by dt is equal to ke into x by c so, so friends we know x by c is equal to volume of distribution then equation number 16 transforms to total clearance is equal to ke into vd parallel equation we can write for renal and hepatic clearance so renal clearance is equal to from ke is ke changes to small e because excretion through urine into vd similarly hepatic clearance is equal to km into vd friends we know friends ke is equal to 0 0.693 by t half where it is comes from t half is equal to 0 0.693 by ke we can make subject ke then we can get 0 0.693 by t half then ke is substituted in equation number 17 total clearance then we can get total clearance is equal to 0 0.693 vd by t half we can also estimate total clearance by non-compartment analysis if the drug is given as iv bolus total clearance we can get by another equation x0 by auc if the drug is given extravascular we can get total clearance is equal to f into x0 by auc where f is a systemic bioavailability if the drug is given as iv bolus if uh, sorry you can find out renal clearance is equal to x amount of the drug excreted through urine at infinity by auc friends or we can find another and then method to find out organ clearance it is the best way of understanding clearance at any individual organ level why because this method is advantageous in predicting and evaluating and evaluating the influence of pathology of particular organ blood flow protein binding enzyme activity and drug elimination so we can find out the uh, organ clearance by these formulas rate of elimination by an organ is equal to rate of present to the organ minus rate of exit from the organ so rate of elimination is equal to qcn what is the q q is the blood flow to that particular organ into cn minus qc out organ blood flow and the amount of the drug excreted elimination is also known as rate of extraction that is equal to q into cn minus c out if we divide equation number 25 by cn then we can get qcn minus c out by cn that is equal to rate of extraction by cn is equal to clearance organ clearance is equal to q into cn minus c out by cn what is extraction ratio extraction ratio is er is equal to cn minus c out by cn it has no units so then we can make equation number 26 is equal to uh, clearance is equal to sense, clearance of an organ organ clearance is equal to q into cn minus c uh, sorry friends then equation number 26 modifies to clearance of an organ is equal to q into er this value ranges from 0 to 1 extraction uh, extraction ratio ranges when we get zero it is no elimination when one means complete elimination based on year drugs can be classified into drug with high year drug with moderate year drug with low year drug with low year we can also find out systemic bioavailability when we know er extraction ratio f is equal to one minus er so friends hepatic clearance suppose we can take hepatic clearance we can uh, we can estimate the hepatic clearance by two parameters if you know total clearance or renal clearance when the mo when the minus renal clearance from total clearance we can get hepatic clearance parallel to these equations we can we can estimate hepatic clearance by another method cl hepatic clearance is equal to qh into erh hepatic extraction ratio and qh is the hepatic blood flow clearance hepatic clearance of drugs is two types drugs with hepatic hepatic blood flow rate limited clearance drugs with intrinsic capacity rate limited intrinsic capacity limit uh, limited uh, limited clearance 
hepatic blood flow means it is perfusion rate limited it is depends upon the blood flow so hepatic clearance of the drug with a high extraction ratio is independent of protein burning and depends upon the blood flow for example for example for this type of phenomenon is propranol beta blocker for the second phenomenon intrinsic capacity limited it is depends upon the hepatic enzyme activity example for this is theophylline hepatic clearance of drug with a low er is independent of blood flow rate but sensitive to changes in the protein binding so friends in my next video i can discuss about one compartment open model iv infusion thank you friends